What's going on guys? Today I wanted to talk about Dynamic DNA Labs. Dynamic DNA gives DNA tests to help you make better choices when it comes to your health and your body. They have a bunch of different tests that you can take like a nutrition test, fitness, skin, personality, ancestry, family, cannabis, and the list is like endless. And basically what they are doing is testing your genetic traits to give you results and feedback to see what you might be more predisposition to, whether it's getting more muscle fatigue faster, whether it's your metabolism rates, um, whether it's your pain tolerance, they can give you all sorts of different insight when it comes to your personal health and your own body. Basically, once you order your kit, they will send you this little box and inside of that box is all the information that you need to take your test. After you open your kit, you're gonna find which kit you bought, which for me, I have a nutrition one, which gives me a little breakdown of the kit I have, and also your registration code on the back, which you'll need to register your kit online so that you can view your results. And then you will also get your instructions of what you're supposed to do with the kit. It's really simple to do. It comes with two swabs, and basically you have to swab your cheek for 60 seconds on each cheek with each different swab. Um, so it's quite a process. You'll be sitting there for a minute <laughs> and swabbing your cheek. And then once you're done, you basically seal it up in this envelope, which you will write your name, your date of birth, and your ge gender on it. That way they know who you are and what you sent them. Once you've sealed your swab inside the container, then you will simply mail it off to them and that is it. It's literally so simple. They will do the processing, they will do the analytics on it, and then they will send you your results to the account online. So I'm gonna go through my fitness test that I've done and share with you some of my results just so you can get an idea of what it's like and so you can see how my genetics are. <laughs> when you first get on your homepage, this is what it's going to look like. Basically, it gives me an introduction of my health and then in each one of these tabs, I can click to see a certain category, um, whether it's my metabolics, how I perform, my recovery, my strength, all these different things will tell me different examples. So let's just start off at introduction. This is what I found out about myself. I have a low tolerance to pain. Now you would never guess that because I'm super strong and manly, but according to my genetics, I might have just a small little bit lower of a pain tolerance than the normal genetics. I don't know if I agree with that, <laughs> but my wife does. She thinks I have a low pain tolerance. <laughs> But anyway, so it's really cool. You click into it and then you get to see, you get to read more about it. So if you don't know what it means, you can click into it and then you can see here, it gives me a breakdown of what pain tolerance is and what it's saying. So it says everyone experiences pain a little differently. Some people may have no trouble sitting for an uh, elaborate tattoo while others may find tears in their eyes. I don't have a tattoo, but I might be the person with tears in my eyes. I don't know. Then if you scroll down a little farther, you will see a references tab where you can do additional reading to learn more about the subject. And they also cite where they got this information from. And then you get to actually see which kind of genetic code or your genotype attributes to you having a low pain tolerance. So this is what mine is. I have no idea what these mean. TT, AA, AA. You know, that's just me, you know, these, this is my DNA. So you're, you're literally watching my DNA right now, live. What a day and age we live in. And then you can go over to the build section. I can look at my blood pressure, muscle growth, pain tolerance, obviously I already looked at that. Muscle volume. So this one's actually interesting. So this is also where it gets encouraging to see what might be beneficial for you. So this for me, I, it says I have an increased muscle volume, which means people with your genotype have an increased volume of muscle. Additionally, your muscles may not break down as quickly as individuals who lack this genotype. So that means that I'm a lot stronger than all of you guys. Even though I might have tears when getting a tattoo, it means I have the capacity to be like Arnold Schwarzenegger, even though I'm not. But what it does actually is encourage me because I think, wow, it says that my muscles will break down, won't break down as quickly as other people because I have this certain genotype. So that's pretty cool because that means if I go in and hit the gym once in a while, 
then I might be able to have these results stay with me longer than someone else who might need to like work for it harder and all that good stuff. So that's actually cool. Maybe I'll hit the gym once in a while now. And for each of these categories, for the purpose of this video so that it's not 10 hours long, I'm just selecting one thing and sharing about it. But really, there's so many different things that you can test and look at and read about um, when it comes to your specific DNA. So that's cool. So I'm in the cardiovascular one. You can see my aerobic capacity. It's average. Slightly enhanced glucose response to exercise. What's nice about it is at first it gives you your results at a glance so that you can quickly scan over stuff, but then you can click into it and do more of a deep dive to understand what does that information actually mean. Motivation to exercise. This is actually interesting because I didn't even know that you could attribute a specific genotype to having the motivation to exercise. I always thought that everyone hated to exercise, but that's not true. Some people are more motivated to exercise based on their genes than other people, which is way cool. And then you have a recovery tab, which this shares with me my ligament strength, my uh, osteoarthritis, um, if I'm at risk for that, or Achilles tendinopathy, all these different things that I might be at risk for an injury. Then moving on to the last tab, which is strength. You can see that I'm average in just about every category besides nerve activity, which if you click into nerve activity, you can see that this means I may experience enhanced muscle strength and contraction, fast reaction speeds. I've always told people that I have the cat-like speed and reflexes. Look out, I've got cat-like speed and reflexes. After you go through your results, you can download this, you can print it, you can have it with you, um, read the information. It's just a cool way to learn more about yourself. I feel like all this stuff does, like whether it's an ancestry thing, whether it's nutrition, it just makes you understand who you are and then it can help you show areas that you might need to work on a little harder than other people, like motivation to exercise. I might need to work on it harder than someone else because they have a higher level of motivation to exercise and I don't. So that just might mean I need to put in a little extra effort in that area. So it's really cool to get all this results. I find it fun to learn more about who I am as a person. It's fun learning about yourself and it just gives you a better idea of how you tick because you might say, oh my goodness, I've been wondering why all these years I've been having a hard time building strength. And you could say, oh man, my genes might not be quite suitable for building strength like some other people's. I might need to work a little harder. I might need to change my diet or whatever it is. So it's really cool. Check it out. Get your fitness kit online at DNA Labs. It's it's cool, I appreciated checking it out. At the end of the day, this is just analytics and information about who you are, but it's up to you to make the choices you do with that information, whether you're gonna exercise more, whether you're gonna change your diet. Thank you, Dynamic DNA Labs, for letting me try this out. It's been a blast. I'll catch you on another video.